The Fed releasing the so-called beige book moments ago, and Steve Leeson has, Leesman has been digging through it. Hey, Steve. Hey, Tyler. Uh, the beige book saying that economic activity was little changed in the period, the six weeks uh, ending in, in April here. Uh, nine districts, uh, first part of April, nine districts said there was no change or a slight change. Two said they saw the outlook deteriorate. That's of the 12 Federal Reserve banking districts. Consumer spending overall was, uh, hold on one second here. Consumer spending was generally flat to down. Price growth was seen as moderate. Auto sales were steady. Uh, manufacturing activity was flat or down. Travel activity picked up. Now, there's some important information here. We've had a chance to look at it briefly. I think the Fed's going to get a lot of uh, uh, sense of what's going on in the banking business from this page book. Lending volumes were down and loan demand declined. That was along with uh, what was said in the prior beige book. Banks tighten lending standards amid uncertainty and liquidity concerns. First time we've had that liquidity concerns in the, in the beige book in a while, certainly. Employment growth moderated somewhat. The labor market was becoming less tight. And price levels rose only moderately, and the rate of price increases appeared to be slowing. There was some modest to sharp declines in non-labor input prices and significantly lower freight costs. Guys, that's where I've been able to get so far. Um, what, I, what I'll do later is dig down into each bank has a banking and finance section in their report of the 12, bank, the 12 banks. So, um, but right now, we're hearing some liquidity concerns and uncertainty. And of course, you guys understand the importance of what's happening in the banking business to the outlook for the economy and, of course, to the Fed. The slowing of loan demand is really one of the things that bears uh, really serious watching, it would seem to me, Steve. I think that's right. I think there's two aspects. Well, there's three aspects to it. One is the the rate, Tyler. In other words, people don't want the the uh, um, the loan because it's too expensive. Mm -hmm. They don't want the loan because demand may be weak. But there's a third aspect to it, which is the one that I think the Fed follows most carefully, which is they can't get the loan because the standards are too tight. How much they have to put up for the loan, what the term of the loan is, uh, other aspects that determine or part of the the uh, the, the, the fine print of a loan document. It's the tightening of lending standards that whatever the rate is, that would tend to increase or cause sort of more concern about the impact of what's happening in the banking business on the, uh, on the economy that would get the Fed's concern.